Hello again, this is Rich, Midstate 515 Resellers, and today we'll do another shipping. It's Sunday, looking at 11.25 a.m., that's Central Standard Time. Um, have a few orders. I have seven on the table, as you can see, possibly behind me. Um, anyway, so some kind of a mixture. We have some Depop, some from eBay. Uh, we have a bundle from Poshmark. Um, I think I'd also like to discuss or, or talk about some, some things that I encountered over the week with, with these sales. Anyway, I thought maybe you'd find those interesting. Possibly you run into these things. If not, maybe you will, or maybe it's just me. I don't know. Anyway, uh, first up is a Depop order. Uh, total sale was $15.75. That included a buyer paid $5.75 um, shipping fee. This is a real Rally Pop. Yeah, we'll go with Rally Pop women's blouse. It's a size small. It's been on the shelves for a while. Um, so let's go ahead and get into this. Here it is. Clean up some of this mess that we've got going on. And with Depop, I ship on, I uh, use Pirate Ship, and they get these plain things. Looks like this is six six 6.5 ounces. Eh, you know, I, I'm wondering, does anybody else get a lot of offers? They're reasonable offers. I appreciate reasonable offers. They're always fairly reasonable on, on Depop. But then they ghost you. If you accept it, you just don't hear back from it. anybody else run into that. That's a lot of my orders are that way. But when they pay, they pay, and they pay pretty well. So I guess I can't fault, fault them for that. So with these, everything gets a thank you sticker. And we, we bag it. Fight with the little... Please and just throw that up there. Okay, six dot seven. We'll go with seven or seven ounces. Pop over here and create a label. Do that. Pop over here. Grab the person's address. Paste that in there. I like to put a rubber stamp with my skew. Um, don't remember what the SKU was, so let's pop over here. It looks like it is V503AL. V503, V503-AL. And we're going to ship that in a poly. And what I say is that six ounces. I ain't. It's interesting when I'm talking and trying to make these things, these videos, I can never remember anything. So I'm um, going to reweigh stuff multiple times. Bear with me. Have patience. We'll get through it together. Go ahead and get the rates on that. Looks like it's going to cost us $4.20 on that ground advantage label. Go ahead and wait for my slow connection. We'll print my label using the Dymo. Um, that's a 4XL. I know a lot of people will use the Rolos. This is what I bought two years ago or when I first started doing this. It's done me well. Um, I guess if it ever stops working perhaps i'll i'll go with a uh, with a rollo um but for now it's a it's a dymo oh we need to grab that tracking number pop over here mark is shipped provider usps tracking oh no grab the address that's not good Let's try that again. Yeah, there we go. Now we've got our tracking. It matches. Mark that as shipped. All right, so that one's done. Let's 
go ahead and tag it. And we're done. Okay, what's next? Go ahead and clean up my, my mess here. All right, so that one's been shipped. Next up is, yeah, well, okay, we'll get on the Ebays. We have three eBay orders. You know, I wanted to mention something about that, too. I don't know if anybody else has experienced this. Um, I don't know what, what's up. We, we, we do promoted listings, and we have done promoted listings, and I haven't changed those those uh, the promoted amount. We do the dynamics, so, you know, we, we've got a cap. Um, and then of course it's supposed to change on a daily rate and sometimes it's not, you know, whatever. Right. So, um, anyway, what I've noticed is the past five days, our promoted listings are down or our impressions, I should say, are down 50% in the last day, last five days. I don't, I don't understand if we haven't changed the, um, what do you call it, the campaign at all, what changed? The other interesting thing is, though, that the our page views remain unchanged. So it, it hasn't impacted the number of views we get, nor has it really impacted our sales. I mean, obviously, sales are down. I think I've heard that out there on YouTube quite a bit. Um, uh, some people are experiencing it. Um, I'm seeing a a decline in sales, um, but if I look back at last year, it's we're doing better than last year, but you know they're still down. And if you look at prior previous months, this this uh, from this year, um, we are definitely down this month. Um, anyway, back to the um, the impressions. Can't explain it. Don't know. You know, maybe there. I noticed that the the top or the recommended or suggested um promotion amount is is now 12 percent. so maybe because we're not at that top tier we're then being throttled or potentially it could be um you know i don't know unfortunately we did recently receive an inad um it's been forever since we've had one of those uh for those of you who don't know that's an item not as described um we did not clearly or adequately describe the color. It's one of those weirdo colors. Anyway, I'm going down a rabbit hole. I'll do that quite frequently. Um, so anyway, that one did get returned, and it was due to that it wasn't. The reason was uh, um, item not as described. Um, additionally, what else did we have? Um, I don't know. We had had. Oh, negative feedback. We'll get into that. I think my wife has some videos um, regarding that whole situation. Didn't like that. That was our first negative feedback in um, in since we started. Um, anyway, I won't go down that rabbit hole. That'll get me on a rant that you just won't get me off of. So anyway, promoted listings, impressions are down. What the heck? I don't know. I think we're, we're going to just kind of kind of ride it out and see what happens. Um, as I said, page page views aren't impacted. Uh, sales numbers don't seem to be impacted. So we'll just kind of see where that's going. And, um, you know, I might have to bite the bullet and increase that. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so anyway, where were we? Let me go back. Oh, yeah, we were back on eBay because we were ranting about the eBay impressions. All right, let's see what eBay's got for us today. Get on that. Get to the view of the page. Um, why don't I have any, any refresh here? There we go. All right. Got three things. Um, sorry, let me. This, I would not recommend this brand. However, um, it is what it is. We. We have it. We did make a profit on it. Not a lot. I'm not going to write write home to mom about it. But it's a true uh, time and true 
girls tank top, size large. Uh, total on that was five, 1099, buyer paid, 599 to ship. Um, so let's go ahead and bag that one up. Go ahead and set that. That's U is W100AH. And W100AH, that warm up. And this one's eBay, so we use our fancy dancy eBay. Get those with our store. Um, Anybody out there with a store and don't know, you do get a coupon from eBay. Uh, we use it towards these, and you can use it for other things that they um, that you can shop for there. Uh, every amount is different. I'm sorry, that was 4.1. Yes, so we're looking at five ounces on that. And... Dimensions nine by nine by, I don't know, two inch, doesn't matter. Um, okay, ground advantage, of course. This is going to Alabama in looking at $4.20 on that. We do charge a flat rate on all our shipping. Uh, we do, it is tiered based on weight, um, but, uh, Kind of averages out. Sometimes we pay more than we anticipated. Sometimes, well, a lot of times we'll pay less. We also will use that that difference to to help mitigate the um, the cost of returns. We do free sh uh, free returns, so that label, um, you know, that return label can be a little costly. Obviously, if it was 420 to send it, it'll be 420 to send it back. I believe. Um, just recently started that this year. Let's go ahead and give them five stars. Woohoo! Good job, eBay. We got our label. Go back to our orders. And next up, we have a Rue 21 women's tank top. Looks, let me get to the label thing here. Um, We'll uh, go ahead and cut some of this so you're not so you're not seeing all this. All right. Okay, so back to the Rue 21 women's tank top. Um, it's at eleven dollars. We buyer paid five forty nine shipping, and so this is uh, going to Nebraska. Not too far away, next door, as a matter of fact. So we'll go ahead and and we'll get that. The skew on that is I603 DK. And again, warm that up. Five point eight. Help me remember six ounces. By the time I sit down in my seat, I'm going to forget it. That is just the way my brain works. If nothing else, you watch this channel and laugh at all the all my dumb things, my silliness. Nine by nine by uh, three, who cares? Let's get that. It looks like it's four dollars and fifteen cents. Print that bad boy. And we'll go ahead and give them five stars. Woohoo! Good job, EA. And back to orders. Tag this. All 
All right, that one's done. Next up, last one for eBay. It's a Worthington skirt. It's a women's size four. Looks like the order total was $15 on that. Um, yeah, so actually, whoa, let's scratch that. Let's go with buyer paid $8 for it. And the shipping is was $5.99. So let's go ahead. Skew is I 200 AO. Put that up there. Right, let's get one of these ready to go. 6.8. So we're gonna go with seven ounces. Uh, it'll be over seven ounces. Better go eight, huh? But time. I get this in a bag. It's going to be eight ounces. And 7.2. So we got to go with eight. And we'll purchase that. And eight ounces. Let's go with the nine by uh, three high. 415 is the label amount. Go ahead and purchase that. Print that. Send our feedback. Go back to our orders. We should be done. All right, that's eBay. Bay is done. What's next? Yes, we did all our eBay. Let me just go ahead and check these off off my list. And ooh, next one up is a Poshmark. It's actually a bundle. This is another great story. Sit back for this one. All right, so. I'll probably need to refer back to my notes on this one because this was, this is, this, I, I can't make this stuff up. Okay, so a couple days ago on Poshmark, my phone's blowing up with, with this buyer liking items. Just bam, 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 bam. Must have been 10, 15 items out there. So I wanted to wait and see, you know, when the dust settled and, uh, about a day or so later, um, she, because I had forgotten about it, she came back and, and in the comments on the bundle asked $40. And I noticed no longer did the, you know, this is a good thing, right? I mean, no longer was the bundle 15 items. She had dropped it down to four. $40 on you know for four items eh, okay 10 bucks a piece maybe i don't know but i still wanted to um still felt that i should you know maybe get a little bit more so i had countered a 48 with a shipping discount so we're not talking a bunch of money here and then uh so nothing has she declined that and then like a day later or so she came back again in comments and said um i can i can only do 40 dollars all right, let me run my numbers. I look at my numbers. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And I forget. Each one of her comments has all these emojis, little hearts, and, you know, please, please, please. And anyway, just kind of silly. But uh, um, so she had declined that $48 offer and then messaged me again and said, hey, I can only pay 40 I redid the numbers and, you know, if it, it, okay, fine. I didn't have any sales. I needed some sales. Not necessarily on Poshmark, but overall the store, you know, as a whole needed some sales. So um, I sent her an offer, like a, an actual offer, $40, no shipping discount, which she declined. So another day went by, by and she messages me again and she says, will you do $20? And I'm going, wait a minute. 40 for four, now we're 24, oh, she dropped to two. What she dropped to, a couple items that were a little more costly. Um, my cost of goods was a bit more, so it was, you know, in that zone, in that gray zone. Um, 
and of course emojis and whatnot. So in the end, I ended up taking the discount or excuse me, I sent her a $20 offer, no shipping discount. I give up uncle, uncle. Okay. She went in and purchased the bundle, <laughs> but here's the next thing. <laughs> this is great. She um, messages back on the bundle and says, uh, any chance this would go next day? Are you kidding? <laughs> really? <laughs> so, you know, I, I mean, the way I understand, I could be wrong, that she paid the $7.95 priority mail um, shipping, you know, standard through Poshmark. Anything over and above, like next day, if I was to upgrade that label, that's going to come out of my pocket, Right. So we are already at a pretty, what I feel is a pretty low, low offer. And uh, anyway, um, yeah, no, that's not going to happen. Sorry, that's the story on that. Sorry. Hopefully you're still with me. Um, so that's a bundle. Let's go back and see what we're bundling. I think I have a pretty good idea of what it is we're bundling. pair of shorts and a pair of jeans i503 okay so it's these two right here and with poshmark i'm going to combine these obviously it's a bundle it has to be under um five pounds we're looking at one pound 15 ounces we could try to stuff it in one of these padded um it's not going to be very easy uh, we do have these tie back. This, um, probably better would be. I was. We were given a bunch of these, uh, so this is a, just a plain standard uh, bubble mailer. And again, um, I'm. It's good up. Poshmark labels are good up to five pounds, so I'm not worried about trying to shave off any. Um, any extra weight. Let's go ahead and we'll just do that. And I'm going to go ahead and throw a piece of tape on that just, just to keep the package together. All right. And that's 2.9. We're well within the limit there. And, okay. That, this Poshmark sends the label to email. So let's go to email, find that bundle. Let's go ahead and print that label it's going to Michigan let's slap the label on there what's in with this what is my problem just I need fingernails Gum it. Oh, there we go. All right. All right. So that's the Poshmark bundle. And that rant is over. And we'll go back. Let's just make it. Go back. Um, next order is a, another Poshmark order. This is a Maurice's size large dress. The midi uh, buyer paid 13 bucks plus shipping. Let's go ahead and get that. It's the last one on my desk. U603. Uh, that's 9.7, so well within the 5 pound. This one I am going to throw in a in a bubble. Go ahead and print that label. 
let's go back to the email. It's this one. And there it is. Print that. Print. And we'll delete that. Go back. That should be that. Okay. Slap a label on here. And that's that. So, what do we have? <sighs> packages. All right. So, packages. Got four and two, six. Six going out. That's all I've got so far. So wish me luck. I'll see you guys next time.